I'll get it. I'll get it. I'll get it. We bought out the department stores. Well, you can put all seven under the, <laughs> under the tree. Merry Christmas, Aunt Harley. Is that for me? You are my absolute favorite niece. Thank you. Any word, Frank? Uh, I'm afraid not, Jenna. But listen, I've got my guys looking all over Chicago for Dad. And even Levy, who's celebrating Hanukkah right now, will let me know the second he finds out anything, okay? It's just so cold out there. Thinking of him outside, somewhere, anywhere, on a night like this, of all nights. Hello? Anybody here? Hello? Where's your mother? Where is she? Oh, don't give me that trusting look. It's Chicago, kid. Mm, yeah. It's Chicago. Where is that mama of yours? I'm not the guy. I'm just passing through, okay? Hey, look, come on, anybody. Look, I got, I got a baby here, if anybody cares. Take care of my baby. He's always happy and doesn't cry much. Tell him I love him and I'm sorry. <sighs> She's sorry. Oh, this can't be happening. Oh. Look. <laughs> Somebody, anybody. I have a situation here and I need help. See, otherwise he'll insist on marrying me and I won't let him do that. Okay? So let's go over this one more time. You're gonna walk me over to the couch and the Christmas tree's under the stairs, right? For a while. Is, is the angel on top the or, or the star? The angel's on top. The angel's on top, okay? And there's a big present wrapped up in front of that tree that Dad did wrapped up in green and red foil. Not as nice as you would have done, of course. In fact, it looks like a child put it together, but... Michelle, I don't know. I don't know if I can do this. You have to. You have to. Aunt Mina or Dad can't suspect anything either. I'll they'll tell Jesse. Please, Rick, you have to help me. This is one last thing I want to give him. It's all I want for Christmas. And that over to the left of your forehead was a kiss. That was on the right. Was it, <laughs> was it a yes kiss? Is there such a thing as a no kiss? I want you to worry because no one is home, okay? Okay. All right, doing great. Hey, look hey. who made it in from the hospital. Hi. You're awfully early. Well, I couldn't wait to see that face. How are you whoa, feeling? Hey, well, oh, great. On. Fantastic. There's no mistletoe here, Romeo. Uh, <laughs> besides, Michelle's got to... Michelle's got to uh, sit down and get some rest here. So what, I need mistletoe now to kiss Michelle? Not if you can take my brother. Yeah, well, don't tempt me. Yeah, you and one army, Pam. <laughs> <laughs> So how you doing? You okay? <gasps> Great, now that you're here. Oh, you feel so good. You too. Well, I came early because I wanted to be the first to wish my beautiful wife to be a very Merry Christmas. Mm. It says just follow the clues and all the joys of Christmas will be yours. So it's like a scavenger hunt. Yeah, let's go. I uh, bet we'd straight to Toyland. <laughs> So can we just go? Yeah. Please. Okay, whoa, 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 not so fast. We don't even know where this came from or who sent it. It came from Santa Claus. 
was. Uh, are you a little suspicious? I didn't say that. Let me take a look at that. There's no clue as to who this might have come from. I don't like it. Do you guys think this is a setup? Could be. Well, I'm, I'm just thinking that with everything that's happened recently, we should be cautious. So what does that mean? Can we go or not? Reva, what is it? Somebody was in here. Somebody slipped into here when we weren't looking. The question is who? Who could it be? Okay, okay, oh, okay. Everybody calm down so we can think this through. Now, obviously, someone is very anxious for us to follow these clues. The question is, who? Well, he has, he dresses in red, and he has a big, long beard. <laughs> Tammy, Tammy, did this man say, uh, give you anything else? He's not a man. He's Santa Claus. Okay, okay, sweetie, he's Santa Claus. But did Santa Claus give you anything else besides this? No, all he gave me was a letter, and then you just slid right off out of the window. Can't we just go, Mama? Yeah, it'll be fun. Yeah, all we have to do is follow the clues and we'll get our surprise. Yeah, but, but you it, see, the, the problem is, sweetheart, we don't know what that surprise is going to be. It does seem awfully tempting. Well, I sure uh, could use a really nice surprise. Yeah. Yeah. Then we are. But I'm still waiting for the other shoe to drop. Okay, everybody, go grab your coats. Okay, where are we going? <clears throat> we are going to follow the first clue to our Christmas soup. Yeah! yeah! Uh, she has some family business to attend to tonight. She'll be here later then, huh? No, actually, she's not going to make it. Oh. Hart should be here by now. Would you get away from the window? He's probably going through some mall looking for a Christmas gift for you. Uh, speaking of Christmas gifts, if you ladies will excuse me, I left a very special mm. gift upstairs. <laughs> I have a feeling I'm going to get my engagement ring tonight. I'd be happy just having Hart. I'm sorry, Dan. I'm sorry that your wedding was botched up, but it's going to happen. You just have to keep the faith, okay? Well, I hope so. I mean, I hope this whole thing was just a temporary derailment, but I don't know what I'm going to do if Cassie keeps chasing after her. Stop worrying about Cassie, okay? Hart's going to figure her out. You are going to wind up with Hart, just like Beth is going to wind up with Phil. Oh, good here. Sweetie, I have to second that. You are stunning, Beth. And I might look a little more stunning if I could get this hooked. Oh, honey, you uh, need to um, do it? Louis and Philip, hmm? could you? Yeah, sure. Jenna, Medina has a very special gift for Coop. She picked it out all by herself. No chewable parts. <laughs> <laughs> no chewable parts. Oh, Medina, that was so... Thoughtful of you. Would you like to come upstairs with me and give it to Coop? Sure. Let's go. <laughs> so, sis, uh, where's the guy? I don't want to hear one word about Philip tonight. Well, hold on here. I thought things were going great with you guys. What's, what's going on? They are. I'm just a little bit tense because of Dad, that's all. And Philip. And Philip. And Philip. It is Philip. I, I, um... I invited him to come and have Christmas with us, but he decided that he wanted to be with Lizzie instead, and I understand that. I really do understand that. Okay. What? What do you mean, what? I mean, what? you're not going to deck me here, all right? But I, I don't think the problem is Philip being with Lizzie. You're too smart for me, Frank. You figured the whole thing out. Yes, it's Beth. Of course it's Beth. Beth? Oh, come on. What? 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 She's, she's got nothing on you. Well, you have to say that because you're my brother and I look just like you. What does she do to you? I need to take care of a little paperwork here. <laughs> huh? I wish you could fix it that easily, Frank. <laughs> What's going on? What happened? Oh, I... Mm -hmm. We had sort of a confrontation the other day and I... I kind of... I, I invited her to compete with me. I told her that if she wanted Philip back, she's gonna have to fight me for him. <laughs> <laughs> so then you punched her in the nose and then you knocked her out, didn't you? Oh my goodness. Yeah, sister. exactly. Crazy, that happened in my dreams. Crazy sister. Well, you know what? For what it's worth, Beth is no match for my beautiful kid sister. No way. You are so sweet, but apparently Philip doesn't agree because he chose Beth tonight. <laughs> 